Good morning. Welcome to our Godly Clay classroom. This is a really special Sunday. As you can see, we are moving down to our final purple Sunday. Um, so I wonder what next Sunday is. There was once someone who, when he was with people, people just felt so much joy and peace. And so many people followed him, but they didn't understand him. Who was he? And so they asked, who are you, Jesus? And he said, I am the light. And so we have that light with us here as we get ready for our story. In the beginning, the baby was born. As the baby grew up to be a young man, Jesus wanted to learn from everyone. Sometimes his parents did not understand him, but he always listened to them. When Jesus grew up to be a man, he was baptized, and people heard a voice from heaven say, this is my beloved child, in whom I am well pleased. Jesus went off into the desert to be alone for 40 days and 40 nights. And there he learned who he was and what his work was going to be. Wherever Jesus went, people's lives were changed by his love and his kindness and the stories that he told, which are called parables. One time, Jesus went to Bethany to be in the house of his friends, Lazarus and Mary and Martha. And there, as they were having dinner, Mary took a bottle of perfume and started to wash Jesus' feet with it. And then she used her hair to dry his feet. The men that were there were upset. Why was she wasting all of this expensive perfume? But Jesus stood up for her. He saw her love and that she just wanted to be close to him. Finally, it was time for Jesus to go to Jerusalem for the last time. He was going to celebrate the holy time of Passover. And so he got a donkey to ride in on. People thought that he was coming to be their new king. But instead of riding on a majestic horse, he rode in on a donkey. And the donkey was one he even borrowed. So I wonder what you have at home that you would like to bring over to add to our story. And if you bring things to add to our story to help us to have a better picture of it, um, I would like to see those. So you can ask your adults in your home if they would share some photos of something that you make or something that you add to the story. Now it's time for us to change the light. The light that is here in one place and in one time will spread out and fill up the area around us. This light is not just here, but it is also with you in your homes and with your families. 